soup's cold. Just took it off the stove. I don't like cold soup. Give me the bread. I guess what, Key? What? I'm getting promoted next week to the crane unit. Well, it's about time. Tony fell off a platform and broke both his legs. Ain't that a break? What'd you do, push him? There you go, always thinking the worst of me. Oh, well, with the baby coming, we can sure use the extra money. It don't take a baby for that. What's keeping Julie? She's upstairs dressing. Oh, now we're dressing for dinner. If she can't eat with the rest of us, she oughtn't to get no dinner. Shut up. Who are you telling to shut up? You heard me. Yeah, I heard you. Fred, don't talk like that to your father. I pay for my keep. I'll say what I want. Oh, sit down. Who's that? I'll see. It's for me, Ma. I'll get it. Give me the potatoes. Hello, Julie. You're early, Ray. I haven't had my supper. Oh, lots of time. Go ahead. I'll wait. Evening, folks. Hello, Ray. Pull up a chair and have some coffee. No, I'll just wait. Thought you got there a machine gun? My trumpet. Say, I just learned a new number. I'm eating. Oh. Now that you're playing in a big nightclub, I suppose you're going to quit the factory. Not right away. But I got to quit the factory soon. You see, the work there is ruining my touch. Oh, get him, Harry James. Well, James had to start at the bottom, too. Yeah, but he could play. Ha! Huh. Why are you always belittling everyone? Where are you going tonight? With Ray. Where I work. You keep out of this. Every time Ray comes over, you pick on him. Since Ray took up with them musicians, I ain't sure he's the right company for you. A lot you care what's good for me. No daughter of mine's gonna run around in nightclubs. Oh, the Black Cat's no nightclub. It's just a nice, quiet little place where fellas take their girls for a sandwich and a beer. I drink my beer at home. It's a new dress, ain't it, Julie? Yeah. Do you like it, Katie? Must have cost plenty. It's pretty, Julie. Thank you, Ma. Let's go. Well, so long, folks. What time are you coming home? I've got a key. Hey, what Pa asked you? You keep out of this. The band plays till midnight. I'll bring her right home. Come on. Hello, Ray. Julie, am I late? Uh, we were just leaving. Gee, that's a swell dress. Well, it only cost nine seventy-five. <laughs> well, nice to have seen you, Helen. Good night. Oh, Helen's coming with us. Surprise. <laughs> yeah. Looking at him like that, it won't take long. Now you're talking like my father. <laughs> am I good or am I good? Don't answer. Drink up. Hey, how about a sandwich? No, thanks. Hello. I'm looking for you. What a break. Harry James is going to listen to you. He, excuse me, ladies. He's down at the barber shop. I told Nick to give him a slow shave. <laughs> he doesn't know me. He will, he will. What a break. What a break. What a break. Don't leave. I'll be right back. I forgot this. I heard the foreman say they're going to lay off a bunch of girls at the factory. There's always another factory. I'd like to take an office job. But you gotta know how to type and take shorthand. Say, maybe we ought to go to business school, huh? Do you know any that are free? Yeah, but the time I pay my room and board, I just have enough to live on.
Hello. Oh, excuse me for living. Uh, you. Danny's the name, Danny Burke. My girlfriend's just dying to meet you. Yes. Well, you are. Do I or don't I? Suit yourself. Some dump. Oh, swimming. No, just broke. That's a swell way of looking for a job. What's your name? Julie. Julie. I'm Helen. Yes, I heard. You come here often? Since Ray started working here. He's a trumpet player. He's pretty good. I haven't seen you here before. I just got in town today. Where from? St. Louis. I've got another one in St. Louis. Paul Wilson. Paul Wilson? Uh-huh. Never heard of him. Cigarette? I don't smoke. If you're looking for a job, what about the factory? I don't think that's for Mr. Burke. There are a lot of things worse than working in a factory. Such as? Well... Goodbye, Helen. Goodbye, Julie. What a strange guy. It wasn't Harry James. Gee, it's a beautiful night. Yeah. Look at the moon. Yeah. It's up there. Hmm? What's up there? The moon. Oh, yeah. Well, guess where I say goodnight. So long, Ray. So long. Bye, Julie. Goodbye. What are you thinking about, Julie? Nothing. Julie? Yeah. If only you weren't taller than me. What difference does that make? Good night, Julie. Good night. Good night. You haven't touched a thing, Julie. I'm not hungry. What's the matter? Ain't our food good enough for you? I wonder what's keeping Fred. Don't worry yourself, Katie. You've got to keep your strength. That's all we need is a brat in this house. You talk as though you didn't want me to have a baby. Fred, for a father, it can't amount to much. Oh, Pa, this is no time to aggravate Katie. Where have you been, Fred? No. I kept it warm for you. Your hands are dirty. Dirty never hurt no one. That's what you're doing! Fred, Pa, please. Fred, come on. Let me know. Come on, get out of here. Get out of here. Come on. Go ahead, get it.